Optimism over trade with China also helped give stocks a lift today. This after a Bloomberg report stated that U.S. officials are getting a final agreement ready for President Trump and Chinese President Xi to sign a bit later this month. Eunice Yoon is in Beijing tonight. The March 1st tariff deadline is delayed and President Trump and his administration are sounding largely bullish that a trade deal can be done. At his press conference Thursday in Vietnam, President Trump said the U.S. and China negotiators were on their way to doing something special. White House economic advisor Larry Kudlow told CNBC that the two sides were on the verge of an historic deal, and Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin said the document is 150 pages and very detailed. The buzz is that the U.S. side is hoping to have the agreement ready so that President Trump and President Xi can sit down for a summit as early as mid-March. Between now and any Trump-Xi summit, President Xi will be preoccupied with a major Chinese political event called the National People's Congress. Huawei's CFO is currently scheduled to have her extradition hearing next week. President Trump has hinted that he could include Huawei in the trade deal. At the same time, President Trump said in Hanoi that he could walk away from any deal, including one with the Chinese. No official comment from China on his remarks. For Nightly Business Reports, I'm Eunice Yoon in Beijing.